This is a gyro stabilizer with the uh, GoPro Hero 3 on it. I basically cut the bottom off of the bowl and left the gyro part intact inside. Ran a one quarter by 20 threaded piece of uh, one quarter by 30 threaded by 36 inches long. Put a weight at the bottom and that's about all there is to it. You got to cut that bowl off the bottom and drill a hole in the bottom of the interior bowl. I thought I was going to use two of these but one on top of the other but I really only needed one so you might get an idea how this works I'll pick it up and you can see how it stabilizes itself there's the bottom where I cut off that red in uh, exterior bowl that's basically how it works tilt back and forth I'm sure someone else can figure out how to put a handle on here I haven't done that yet but It'd be interesting to see how you fellas can work on this. When I was talking of that bottom bowl, this is the second one I bought. I bought them for five bucks a piece at uh, dollars and less. You need to cut this bottom part off so that it'll, you can put the thread and bolt through there so you can balance it at the bottom. Here's how it looks cut off. I cut it off with a with a Dremel tool and it cut it off pretty slick. Of course uh, that plastic wants to fuse but it'll break right off the little little uh, nubs on there will break off. And no, uh, I didn't do that to my thumb today. I did it about three months ago. Gyro with the gopher on the top of it. Uh, just gonna walk along and see how fast, how smooth it is. Then I'll turn around and kind of run a little bit. This is a test of the little gyro bowl slice gyro with the gopher on the top of it. Uh, I'm just going to walk along and see how fast, how smooth it is. Then I'll turn around and kind of run a little bit. on this thing and trying to fix something for a gyro stabilizer. Okay.
it's kind of funny that uh, an old knock top came up with this because this is pretty interesting because I've been trying to figure out how to use a globe or whatever idea to come up with a stabilizer. I had these uh, little strips of uh, stabilization Teflon coated over a Teflon coated globe or ball with handles with the uh, rod going through with with uh, weights down at the bottom and uh, it was just serendipity that I saw this on Noptop. Of course I'm subscribed to him. Uh, he comes up with some pretty interesting ideas. But uh, I thought this might work but uh, it took a little more engineering and it looks like uh, gyro bowls already helped us out in that respect. This is what the uh, gyro bowl packaging looks like. I don't, of course, there's not the bowl in there now, but that's the outside of the package. In case you guys are going to uh, a dollar, five dollar or less store to get this thing. I imagine at Walmart or Kids or Us or Babies or Us or whatever. <laughs> 